We're going to look at the corkscrew now. Make sure that you do the spine twist supine or the knees side to side exercise before you approach this exercise. The corkscrew builds up on your ability to take the pelvis from side to side and control it with your waist muscles. So Camilla, if you can please open the arms just a little bit wider than the mat, like this. Bring the legs to tabletop and then stretch the legs up towards the ceiling. That's great. Now we're going to do a pendulum, meaning inhale, legs over to one side, exhale to draw back towards the center. Inhale over to the other side, exhale, draw back to center. Let's do it a couple more times and let's make sure that the shoulders remain on the floor. The chest is open, the arms are long, the shoulders are on the ground. Inhale over, exhale back, inhale over, exhale back, inhale over, exhale back. We're going to add on to that the corkscrew, the rotation of the legs. So we inhale to go over to the right and then we circle the legs back to center. Over to the left, around and back to center. Over to the right, around and back to center. And let's pause for a moment. Bend your knees for me, just rest. As you do that circular movement with the legs, you must keep moving the pelvis from side to side with control. You don't want to arch the back as you do that, and I'll show you exactly what I mean now. So, let's go over to the right. And now, Camila, arch your back, do an anterior toe, that's it, as you go around. So that was really unstable in the pelvis and straining on the back. We go over, and as we circle the legs, we keep the abdominals in, and we keep the support to the center. Why don't you bend the knees? I think I've moved you a little bit. Just straighten yourself a little bit to the left. Yeah. And do it without me, please, a few times. So, lift the legs. And here we go. Over and round back to center. Over and round back to center. Please do it a couple more times. She's making sure to draw the abdominals in to stabilize the lower back. That's it, to stop the lower back from arching away from the ground. And remember the upper body, nice and open. And that's probably enough. And that's the corkscrew. 